in this video we are going to read excel using open py excel i have created two parts to cover this topic in this part we will access cells directly so first is we are going to access one particular cell then we are going to access a range of cell then one particular column range of columns one particular row and uh, range of rows now let's open one excel and uh, try to understand this so over here you can see me zoom in so if i wanted to access this particular cell then i need to provide a2 the cell address over here and then i can access this particular value similarly you can access any other cell just by providing its uh, cell id now let's say like i need a range of cells then a1 to this particular cell so i have to provide the first cell the last cell in this range from a1 to c7 now if you wanted to access using a particular column then we have to provide the column id a b c like that if it's a range of uh, columns then provide the slicing information like from a to b or a to c like that If it is a particular row, then we have to provide the row ID over here. It's two. Or if it is a range of rows, then provide this range two to five. Now let's understand uh, that concept. So if it is a particular sale, then we are just providing its particular ID. The range of sales, then we are providing the address using the slicing if it is a particular column we are providing column id similarly range of columns row and range of rows now let's see the demo in this code you probably know about these four line first four line which we are using for last couple of videos now over here what i'm doing is just passing the cell address over here to this uh, excel sheet uh, object then we are getting its value if i'll open the excel you can see in a1 we have name as value let me run this code and see if we are getting it or not well before that i have to you can see over here we got the value of cell a1 now let's see how we are going to read a range of cells so for that if you see over here we have passed uh, listing information saying from a1 to c7 we wanted to read this will return the range of the data it will be uh, like first we have to get the row then we can access the cell for that i'm just using two for loops over here the first for loop is iterating through all the rows and the second for loop is iterating to that row to get a particular cell and finally printing the value over here i will open that excel set just to understand this whenever we pass any cell range say like a1 to c7 we are getting these all of these information so first we have to iterate this particular row and then we can go through each of these cell now let's close this one let me run this code now over here you can see we got uh, first row in informations then this is the second row informations 
and this is fifth third row information similarly we got all these required data over here now let's try to read one particular column so over here i've just passed the column information i'm going to read the c column and then i have just printed that column information and use the pretty print so that it will be a little bit uh, better to see in the console and uh, finally i'm using one for loop to see all the value in this particular column so c column is this one and we should get all these values let's run the code and over here you can see we got the sales informations like it started from cell c1 c2 all up to c7 and similarly we got the value of those sales over here now let's see like how we can access the range of sales so over here i've just passed the range of sales from a to c column and again over here you can see i have used two four loops over here the first one will give me a particular column and then the second loop will print its value run the code or uh, let's see the data from a a to c this and it should be from column by column and over here you can see we got all these set of columns we started from column a then it moved to column b then column c similarly we have all these value for column a these are the value for column b and these are the value for column c now we are going to read one particular row so over here i have given uh, row number two and then using the for loop to access all the value in this particular over here you can see row two is information about ross run this code and And over here you can see we got uh, this particular row information a2 b2 c2 d2 ross all this information about ross finally in this video we are going to read the range of rows starting from second row till fifth row again i have used uh, two loops over here same concept now let's open the excel input over here you can see second row is information about ross and the fifth one is about pb run this code and see the output and you can see all this sale address information over here and all the value over here it started from ross till pb so basically in this video we cover how to read one sale range of sales one particular column range of columns and a particular row or a range of row you just need to remember those sale address and slicing information thanks for watching.